Greetings. Hello. So we have Bharat Mada here and with her blessings let us proceed with the video. So in this video I'm just going to do something which is in close relation to the previous video of mine whereby we saw as to how the Rudraksh reacted to water and deities. Alright. Uh, so in this video I would like to particularly compare between drinkable consumable water and non consumable water right so let us have some brief intro to the rudraksh right so mala so what is the rudraksh rudraksha literally translates to shiva's teardrops right rudra pertaining to shiva and aksha pertaining to teardrops so as we know all substances have their own vibration say for example this bottle or the oil or some other substances each of them have their own vibration right so rudraksh is one sub particular substance which has its unique vibration which is present in no other substance at all right so it has its own unique vibration and everywhere or, or per person who wears the rudraksh you can feel it all right they can definitely feel the uh, energy or that it radiates all right so the rudraksh has uh, many many benefits plenty of benefits for example it cleanses your aura right it cleanses your aura and also it protects you from a lot of this kind of you know negative elements black magic sort of things and it protects you from these things and it you know, it may be handy when you're traveling, you're getting to new places where those environmental energy may not be suitable for you. And you, that the root drugs can help in these kind of things. And there are many, many other benefits, right? And there are many types of root drugs also, uh, ranging from one phase to 21 phases. And each type confers different kinds of specific benefits, right? Like well-being and things like that. And it may also be well advised that you understand the Rudrakshas properly before randomly purchasing one. Because some Rudrakshas can give an effect that you may not be prepared for. And please do not misunderstand that the Rudraksha should give a bad effect or a negative effect. No Rudraksha should give a bad effect. It's just that they may give an effect which you are not prepared for. For example, the Ekamugi, they said that when you wear the Ekamugi, you would leave your family within 12 days, alright? And the Ekamugi is considered as a very rare Rudraksh, alright? So, what happens here is the Rudraksh creates, this particular Rudraksh creates an environment of, or uh, brings you to the direction where family situations would not be suitable for you. So, this can be a very powerful tool for spiritual aspirants who want to isolate themselves and spiritually progress in solitude. This will be a very handy tool for them but it may not be so with a uh, family man family people all right they may not be prepared for such situations of leaving your family just like that right so different root drugs can confer different benefits so it may be best to understand them properly uh, they generally like root drugs just like panjamogi they can be worn by everyone because they give uh, universal effects like health well-being and things like that all right so let us go on with the demonstration so as we know let us recap from the previous video if we place the rudraksh on top of a food substance or water it would rotate clockwise okay the rudraksh can react to many other particular things in the previous video for example we saw how the rudraksh reacted to deities it can even react to mudras your hand gestures and things like that but in this particular video i'm just going to experiment with the water substances all right so yes and if it's clean it would rotate uh, clockwise if it's polluted or poisoned it would rotate anti-clockwise all right so let us see what we have here this is a drinkable water boiled water right and this is milk and why are they here I'm gonna drink them but prior to that uh, I'm gonna experiment them with the root drugs you can join me for a drink later as well or a sip maybe <laughs> all right so let us begin okay, let's bring it to a stop 
See, I'm just displacing it with my fingers. So as you can see it's rotating clockwise so concluding that the water is drinkable and of course it is it's drinking water right next let us see with the milk Okay, so we have concluded that these two items can be drank. Okay, so next, I'm going to go to a lake. Okay, it's a beautiful environment, but I don't think I can consume the water. Okay, there are some unsightly particles floating, like this algae and some, I don't know, some other things. Right. Anyway, let's let our drugs decide on that. Okay, so I'm just holding the Rudraksh by the string okay and I'm going to just uh, stop its motion and see the magic So it uh, rotated anti-clockwise and my assumptions have been proven true. We cannot consume this water. Maybe we not, we may not die instantly, but it probably is polluted. That's the point, right? And it wouldn't do good to our well-being. Okay, so this is a demonstration as we how we detected between polluted water and clean water. All right. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Nice birds singing. You, sh you should listen to the birds singing. It's really beautiful.